Hello, my dear students. This is Lina Abdullah, your IT teacher. Welcome you in our unit video, where I'm going to introduce our unit in this course, which is 21st Century Advanced Skills. By end of this course, you will be able to get your advanced ICDL certificate. In order to achieve that, we have some certain topics we need to cover, we need to practice, and even we need to sit for our external exam and pass it. In this unit, which is, uh, will be our first unit in this course, um, advanced Excel module, which is considered as professional uh, module called professional ICDL. What do we have in this unit? In this unit, we have the first module, which is the advanced spreadsheet module, covers the advanced skills needed to use fee, uh, its features of spreadsheet to produce report, provide statistical or mathematical analysis, and manage data more effectively and productively. The benefit of database decision making are widely organized. All types of organization need workers who are able to use spreadsheet effectively, not just for storing tabular data, but for the sophisticated way that spreadsheet can be used to validate, inter interpret, and present information. So this is the, uh, uh, a brief description for this module where we are going to hit different topics in order to be professional with using Microsoft Excel. By end of this module, you as a student will be able to understand advanced formatting option, including conditional formatting and customized formatting, recognize which function to use in formulas and troubleshoot errors. You will find that you will be able to create your own formula to do certain calculations, identify the correct chart to display a specific data set and create or edit such a chart where you will be um, able to manipulate your chart in a way to present uh, certain data and format it. Also, we'll go over the analyzing, validating, auditing, and protect data, and time-saving uh, features such as linking data, base special filters, and macros. I'm sure some, mainly most of these skills you are not familiar with. That's why the target of this uh, course to prepare you for a higher level of skills in Microsoft Excel. Uh, here you will find ICDL practice where you can go to the testicdl.com website to do more practice for Microsoft Excel exam, uh, where also you'll find the video. Uh, uh, of course, Excel, it's a very helpful tool to be integrated with math, where you can uh, integrate Microsoft Excel easily with other subjects, especially in math, where you can perform calculation, anal calculations, analyzing data, solve mathematical problems. Also, you have a wide range of functions, tools, which will help you to perform mathematical operations and create complex mathematical models. If you go to over the office support, you will find different tutorials, fun uh, topics, uh, guidance for using the functions and formula in Excel. Also with science, using Excel is very important where you can integrate Microsoft Excel with the science uh, for analyzing data, visualization, modeling, a user-friendly interface to perform calculations, create a graph, and organize scientific data. My dear students, you will find that using technology and IT skills with all other subjects is something very helpful where you can, let's say, uh, produce a professional work, uh, help you with uh, focusing on certain uh, ideas, topics, apply calculation, graphing things. You can do all of that using the computer software or computer application. Also here you'll find more details about uh, import data into Excel and create data modeling uh, where or model data through Office support website. Uh, for our unit project, you will be able to calculate the area under graph, 
uh, sorry, under Curve using Microsoft Excel. Here is in this project, you will calculate the product of the f of x values and the increment of x for example, if your x value are in column B and the corresponding f of x value in, are in column C starting from row two, where you will, uh, I will guide you through this unit to know, uh, sorry, through this project to know exactly what you have to do. We have uh, our main target is to calculate area under curve uh, and you will find more sub, uh, resources will help you to uh, go with your project like tutorial, uh, interactive simulation uh, where I support you with a, a online calculator to check your calculations. Uh, also, you will find more details through the office support will help you to read about calculations using Excel. By end of this project, you will be able to create a, a professional formatted Excel sheet to calculate area under curve to show the calculations for a certain area. And here also you'll find the project, uh, the rubric of the project. Uh, by end of this unit, you'll find yourself that um, able to implement the Microsoft Excel feature, especially the advanced one uh, through your learning, learning uh, the one you learned through your learning journey, uh, journey sorry. Uh, this module covers advanced skills uh, will, uh, to produce reports, statistical, mathematical anal analysis, and manage data more effectively. Uh, of course, uh, by passing the external exam, you will be able to get your certificate. And here you will find more details about the international, through the international ICDL website, about the course and other courses within this organization. And I am sure we have more topics we'll cover within this course, will prepare you effectively uh, to be professional in using these applications. Of course, we have the resources pages or study page where you'll find more resources help you with uh, getting ready and understand more certain topics uh, go over tutorials through youtube will take you directly to microsoft excel and advanced skills of it also you can practice different questions through quizlet and quizzes and you have some uh, let's say uh, common or international uh, resources you, uh, to find specific topics uh, or information about specific topics. My dear student, this was uh, a quick introduction for our unit. Uh, I wish everything is clear. And you have, if you have any questions, just refer to me anytime. Thank you for listening.